Hey there friends, so I found the craziest Minecraft mod that basically turns it into a Stardew Valley. You can grow and maintain crops, you villagers, you can build new village buildings, you have to do tasks, but let me show you rather than tell you. Okay, here we are. I, can I see other square planets as well as a rainbow? And I don't know what the hell this is. I don't think this is part of the mod. I'm afraid to, oh wait, there is a way out. Okay, <laughs> I'm just exploring. Maybe this is like a wizard tower. Oh no, oh no, okay, it's just a skeleton's tower. I'll invade you later when I'm bigger and stronger than you. Summon the harvest goddess. <laughs> oh, and that'll lead me to getting a carpenter in my town. And I guess this is my town. <laughs> What the hell is that? Am I under attack? Oh no, I earned an achievement. <laughs> I was just getting non flashbacks. Okay, I've got this guide on how to bring the goddess. In this pack, your goal is to build up a town, harvest crops, and sell them at your town to get coins. These coins can be used to buy items, parts for other mods in the pack. Find three vanilla flowers, one flower pot, one stick, and one bucket with water. Oh my god, okay. Also, I'm not sure if you can see it, but it says right here, really small. Can we zoom way in? Yeah, there we go. Sacrifice a child. Okay, so I've got this set up, and uh, I couldn't find a child but I found this guy instead. There we go. Okay, I hope this works. Oh, I think it's working. Yes, it worked. She's like, oh my god. Why did he sacrifice him? That had nothing to do with this. Okay, village destroyed, big storm, yada yada yada. All right, she gave me goddess flowers. So will I sacrifice someone every time I want you to show up or? I'm not hearing a no. <laughs> okay, she wants two dozen logs and then we'll have enough to build the carpenter's shack. The hell is this? Oh, it's a nest. I like that up the top it tells me what it is, given that it's a mod and it has a lot of new items. That's pretty cool though. Like if it didn't tell me what it was, I would have 100% smashed that bird nest. <laughs> I'm getting achievements. I thought this was like every time you cut down a tree for a second. I was like a little over the top. That's gonna be a bit annoying. <laughs> Alright, where's that self-proclaimed goddess? I don't know if I believe in a goddess that doesn't want sacrifices. There you are. Okay, I got you your logs. This is a structure blueprint. You use them to select the area you want a building to be built. Why am I not reading this? I, I just started skipping through. Why do I keep skipping? Don't worry if he dies from some tragic accident. Okay, I got that covered anyway. Okay, blueprint carpenter. I guess you can... Oh, that's, that's really cool. Okay, you can live over here. I might need to clear a bit of space. I just imagine the carpenter, you know, would live on the edge of town near the forest. Lots of uh, area to build. There. Oh, and it just gets insta-built. Nice. Oh, never mind. Do I don't have to build that, do I? Sneak and right-click to confirm. Oh, he's building it! So all I had to do was sit back and watch him build. I think I'm gonna like being the leader of this little town. I had tried a villager challenge before, but that was a lot of manual labor. This is just like a dictatorship. And look at that craftsmanship. He's good at what he does. I gotta say, 100% a better carpenter than Robin. He's gonna be building a lot for me. Well, I don't know about you, but I'm exhausted. I'm going to bed. Oh, who the hell are you? <laughs> oh, wait, I think the fairy lady or whatever told me to bring her a flower. Is this a flower? Oh, I better not take <laughs> their stuff. They just moved in. I don't want to alienate them. Uh, as well as the carpenter, you're now the town hero. You, uh, best of luck. <laughs> there you go. She said she couldn't accept a gift from me and then just took it anyway. That's it. I'm moving in. No, oh, there's monsters nearby. Can you take care of him, dude? Did, did he? <laughs> oh, no, I can hear him. There you are. All right, now, can I sleep in your living room? Yes. <laughs> the door open and everything. <laughs> They're like, I don't know if this guy should really be the leader. <laughs> Damp grass, biomes are plenty. It's like if the biomes were Irish. All right, goddess, come back to me and tell me what I have to do. I'm happy to give you a starting gift of 1,000 gold. This person's the best. It's like the opposite of Animal Crossing. All right, well, I think I'm good to go and set up my village. That is under attack by zombies, but don't worry, the zombies are on fire. <laughs> don't know if that would calm anyone down or not. <gasps> I got a statue noise. I don't know what for, but I did something. Ah, she's gonna teach me about crop farming. Oh my god, there's a creeper right outside. What will I do, man? <laughs> I'm not the main character, remember? You have to do something. Oh god, no, I was trying to eat the apple. <laughs> oh my god. I could always use new materials to help me build. Yeah, that's great. You guys in denial that we're in a crisis situation. <gasps> it's backing off. Okay, open the door and sprint away. I just don't know what'll happen if I blow up his house and I don't really want to do it like five minutes into the video. Ow. Jesus, this village is in an awful area, you know. I know I'm the one who picked it, but it's just annoying. Like, there's monsters everywhere. The land must have been cheap, I guess. 
I think it just makes that noise anytime I pick up something good, or maybe if I kill. Although I didn't hear it when I sacrificed the child. Okay, how many seeds do they give me? I have to water my plants and everything. Okay, I have these planted. Can the carpenter make me a house too? You're so much better at building. Building the best buildings for you. Yes, I'd like a, a house. I didn't actually realize I could do this. I just wanted to kind of complain. A general store. Oh, I want a general store. Yes. Why does it cost so much? A shipment box? That's probably for selling. I should get that. Ah, I see you have the same rip-off prices that they do in Starchy Valley. Staying really true to the game. Okay, we want a shipment box. I need 16 wood and then a general store. Store. By the way, if you want to play the mod, it's called Farming Valley. You now, if you just can't decide between Stardew Valley and Minecraft, now you don't have to make that decision. You can play a very strange mix of the two. Like, can you sacrifice people in Stardew? No. Can you be overwhelmed by capitalism in Minecraft? No. <laughs> now you can do both at the same time. Okay, I want a shipment box. Buy. Oh, God damn it, I bought two! It's so small. <laughs> right, I'll put one over there and, I don't know, one up by his house, I guess. And then just so we're clear, how does this work? How do we put stuff in? <laughs> Maybe he doesn't buy rotten flesh? All right, we'll learn. We'll learn in time. At least it's there for us. And I should build, like, a little hut to sleep in at least. Even though I could just live with them. And then whenever I build a bigger house, I could move into that. Or I could fix up the thing behind. But that's kind of out of the town center then. I want to be the center of attention. How easy is it to water plants in this? Please be easy. Okay, it's very easy. <laughs> Thank goodness. Maybe I should just grow these out um, so I can move on and they can teach me a bit more. <laughs> Oh, accidentally typing in chat there. <laughs> it's just a sound I make when I sleep. W -W 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 I guess I could just sleep outside under the stairs, right? <laughs> like, if I sleep so early that no monsters can spawn, it's excellent. And it definitely has the, um, Stardew vibe where you can just sleep at any time. My turnips are already done. I thought it would take much longer. Hey, I have your turnips. Although I don't know what we're doing with them. I guess you could say, turn up for what? <laughs> You can sell whatever you grow for gold. You'll just need a, a shipping bin. I'm one step ahead of you. Okay, so you do just right click, but I guess they weren't buying rotting flesh for some reason. Wait, you can put a hopper into the bin so it'll automatically do it. Oh my god, I need to set up some automatic farm or something. Okay, Jade is saying she'll give me seeds, but I should build a general store to get better ones. Okay, these people have been very, very helpful, I must say. Let's see, how much will I get for these? I'm gonna put all nine in there and just go to sleep. You know, it's almost 7 a.m. I'm very sleepy. Ship ahoy! Hey, where's the money? I got nine. <laughs> I got one gold for each of them. Good lord. Okay, what if I just pick up all of these flowers and I give them all to her and then she'll give me more, right? And I'll just go on a huge farming spree to make a ton of money in one go. I don't know, is it worth exploring? Like, can I find stuff worth selling? I should at least make the basics and check out the two buildings near us just in case. She gave me turnip seeds for them. Okay, I have more. Look, this, this mystical red flower. She always says I cannot accept a gift from you and then she she takes one anyway. And like, if they're all turnips, it probably isn't even worth doing, right? Wait, it grows. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I, am I doing this wrong? Oh my god, okay, I have way more potential here than I thought. Hello? You don't happen to have like 2,000 gold in here, do you? Are you interested in investing in my town? <laughs> okay, it is completely empty. It does give me a nice view over the place, so I'll definitely have to do something with this. I was like, oh my god, another building, but that's the carpenter's house. <laughs> the hell is that? A meadows hive. Okay, that's neat. And we got some ores here, maybe? Ow. What? <laughs> is that a ghost? Or, or maybe one of these stung me? Do you want to sting me, little fella? Let's start jumping on their hive. Do you want to sting me? <laughs> Do you? <laughs> I'm like designing the layout of my house here and I don't have a house. Like I'll build the walls around it. <laughs> what the? <laughs> Why does that skeleton have googly eyes? <laughs> the way he looked at me. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, now I'll try. Is it when I like try and hit the blocks they're attacking me? I I'm really not sure what's happening here. I saw you staring at me. There's no point in looking off. Yeah, look, look back at me. Yeah. What were you looking at, huh? <laughs> trying to make a living here. Sure, I don't have a house. <laughs> but you're not exactly helping me. Right, I'm going to bed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love how it puts up my health as well when I sleep. <laughs> Just so much less stress. Oh, I got my turnips ready. This one grew slower. Maybe I didn't water it or something. Anyway, like this, I'll have a general store in no time. And by no time, I mean 73 years. She's not gifting me any more seeds. It's pissing me off. You may have noticed some rocks, weeds, and sticks laying around. You can break these for some stone or log. Oh, I did notice that. Just jumped on one of my crops and destroyed it. Excellent. I was looking for a rock to show you. I got distracted. 
Okay, let's check out this other house if there's anything in here. I'm not expecting it, but we'll try anyway. No, nothing. It's a fine house, though. Well, it was in its prime, I would imagine. I'm just scavenging for anything I can sell now. <laughs> I really want that general store. Wait, did I throw that egg or did I sell it? Okay, I think I'm throwing them. <laughs> I got an eggshell. <laughs> no, they don't want to buy the eggshell either. <laughs> Turnip for what? <laughs> this is so sad. Oh, wait, that got me a lot of money that time. How come some of the turnips were so much better? Hey, I got more flowers for you. You want to give me more turnips? Damn you. <laughs> okay, thank you, Zephyr Wind Spirit, for making a guide on Reddit on how to be better at this. So I think the two things I took away that are most important right now is every five flowers she gives you seeds. And at first she'll give you hardy turnips, which only sell for one each, but later you get regular ones, which sell for 60 each. So that is fine. We can do that to get the store. And don't be afraid to loot your town's buildings for shippable goods. Hay bales convert into wheat to sell, and wheat is 100 each. Good to know. There was also other things like go fishing, was a tip and if you find a village it might contain an npc that'll give me a quest so my plan is pretty much just sleep and give her flowers <laughs> just take my gift to let me simp god damn it <laughs> all right come back to sleep <laughs> achievement friends i don't care about being a friend i want seeds i think i actually gave her mushrooms once instead of <laughs> flowers i'm not the sharpest tool in the hot bar you know Thanks for the flowers. Here's a bag of seeds. Thank you. Wait, you didn't even give me the bag. She took everything from me. <laughs> well, look at you. You're an ugly little thing, aren't you? Oh, you're a kiwi. What a strange interaction for that kiwi. I'd just go up to it, call it ugly, and then tell it what it is and run off. <laughs> Imagine someone came up to you like, oh my god, you're ugly. <gasps> you're a human! <laughs> and just runs off. Just realized, thank god I have a map, because I, I ran off into just the abyss. I don't know where I am. But I've got five roses for her, so I'll give her five and one bag and then she'll have to give me seeds. Otherwise, by this village's laws that I have set in stone, she will be executed at dawn. Just another sacrifice for the goddess. She is bloodthirsty, isn't she? Have a bag of seeds. Yes! Okay, so you just talk to her with the flowers in hand and she just gives it to you. No, 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 I just want flowers. No, he poisoned me. Oh God, awkward, awkward, awkward run. Wasn't even the danger, it was just the social awkwardness of bumping into him like that. Oh Jesus Christ, I was out simping all day and I nearly went straight down a hole. All right, I have lots of flowers to give her now. I don't know why I didn't get that, like I had to give her five each time. I, I thought it would just be one for one. It's kind of a ripoff. Okay, I want to get these planted because then the rain will do my work for me. And without the rain, it's gonna be a little bit annoying to water all of these. <laughs> What the? Uh, guys, <laughs> I'm in the void. <laughs> I must be out of energy. Yeah, I'm exhausted. Got a little bit of blindness as well. You know, these things happen. I'll just start putting down the seeds. Ah, no! Oh, <laughs> my farm. I thought I was safe in the void. I thought I could avoid the danger, you know? It's in the name. Okay. <laughs> I just passed out. I was like, I'm just gonna push through and then I just collapsed in the field. The poor old Irish farmer, his income is so small. Industrial hemp seeds, okay? <laughs> can't be planted. Buy the seeds from shops. Why can't I plant? Why do I have googly eyes? Ah, why does he have googly eyes? <laughs> I don't understand some things going on in this mod. Okay, well, it worked out perfectly in the end. That explosion left me with this amount. No. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, that's right. No, don't run on my crops, you bastard. It's already been rough for the crops. Okay, I think the best thing here is just speed run watering them and then sleep immediately <laughs> before more disaster hits these crops. Like, I'm definitely on, like, a burial ground or something. There's so much dead showing up. And my crops are cursed. My friends look dead inside. They just stare at each other and then stare at me. All right, I think one more night should do it. I like that I literally pushed myself to blindness through exhaustion last time. It's very me. Just like, let's just see how this plays out <laughs> and just keep pushing. All right. Some of the survivors from the original grow are done. I just need to grow these and I think I'll have enough for the store. I hope I'll have enough for the store. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Please sleep. Please sleep. God damn it. All right. 36 turnips. Just absolutely stuffing this box. <laughs> 
Yes, that's what I'm talking about. All right, when do you open? When do you open your store, huh? If you're looking for buildings, I'm afraid I'm only available 9 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. Sunday to Friday. Thank you, Ulif. <laughs> I'm not sure why you have that accent when your name is Ulif, by the way. I've been collecting flowers while waiting for that dude to open, so I can actually get a lot of tulips for free again. Not tulips, turnips. I'm not a very good farmer. I just gifted him a flower that I needed. God damn it. Ow, ow, do something, do something, Carpenter. <laughs> We're under attack. Oh. There we go, I'm a hero. You should, like, give me more turnips. Oh my god, I forgot about the wood that I need. Ready? All right, let's get chopping, I suppose. <laughs> Actually, I probably shouldn't do it near my house or I'll ruin the entire area. <laughs> Okay, good news everyone. Our turnips are ready and I think I have enough wood to actually get the general store. Ah, uh, one didn't grow. It's just a little bit slow, but with the right care and guidance, it could be a beautiful turnip. But I don't have that, so I'll just destroy it and move on. Come on, open your store. <laughs> I'm your only customer. What are you even doing? <laughs> no. All right. <laughs> I'll come back in a while. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, watch out behind you. <laughs> Run. <laughs> his eyes may be silly, but his powers are deadly. Down you go. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, well, it's ruined the landscape, but that's all right. Uh, you know what? We can make it work. It's kind of cool if you don't think about it. All right, one natural disaster. Now we are ready to shop. I need 64 stone. God damn it. <laughs> All right, at least for this one, I can just go to sleep. Wait, did I water the plants? Yeah, I watered. Okay. I care deeply for my turnips, except for that one I murdered earlier. I didn't like that one at all. Okay, sleeping doesn't make that smell faster, but that's okay, because we need to plan where to put the store. I guess it depends what size it is, but I'm thinking here, like next to the water, and then I build some sort of an extension over the water where I live, because I'm guessing I'll need to use the store all the time, so it makes sense. I'll just have like a little granny flat on the side of the store. Why do I always like make myself a sidekick or just an accessory to the main plot when I'm the main character? No, don't worry, I'm making it better. <laughs> it's fine, I'm actually doing good stuff for once. Not really sure why I have to do it when the guy's a feckin' carpenter, but I guess Jesus was a carpenter as well, and people probably complained he wasn't doing enough carpentry. So, you know, maybe there's a point in that somewhere. I'm not sure. <laughs> Even he's pretending not to notice me now. Oh, what is that in the sky? Oh my god, oh my god, what is that in the sky? All right, I'm gonna sleep now, because that thing still needs a little more time to finish, and I didn't want him to close his shop because that's like something he would do to me. The guy is just not nice. In fact, I might immediately sleep again and just get my turnips done. <laughs> Okay, we nearly have enough. I've even built a path all the way down to where the store is gonna be while I wait for this. It goes right through my crops, unfortunately. Something tells me I should figure out how to make a cobblestone generator. I feel like I'm gonna need a lot and maybe a few furnaces. Okay, we have everything. The store just opened. Incredible timing, Kevin. General store. Oh my god, it's massive! No wonder it costs so much. You know this is a general store for three people, right? You sure you- Alright, okay. Okay. This is going to look ridiculous, man. This could be like half the size. So I can like place it and then I can go around, which is really help. <sighs> which would have been really helpful. So I guess I just need to clear enough space so it'll actually fit here. And I might hide it behind the trees. It might make it look a bit nicer. Oh no, there's even a bit jutting out at the back. Okay. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> ah! Oh, you didn't even warn me, you bastard. Oh my god, I placed my village in a horrible, horrible area. I should have gone to, like, flat plains. But it does link up with this tower, and it's gonna look way cooler than any other village, okay? Is he going? Oh yeah, finally, he's leaving his doorstep. Watch the crops, you fecker! <laughs> Uh, 
Hello? Oh, you got buttons on your wall. I'm gonna click them all. <laughs> They're like, okay, you're banned. You're banned from the store. I could not be happier right now. Okay, <laughs> it's nice to meet you too. Thursday to Sunday between... Wh what? <laughs> Thursday to Sunday? I need to wait? Ooh, this is cool. Oh, wait, there's someone else here. Jenny. Okay, how do I do a voice for Jenny? Hey, a friend, just to remind you, we're open every day except Wednesday and Sunday from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Okay, awesome, Jenny. Thank you. So there's two different, like, little shops. He's got a workshop and she's got like a general store. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh no, I just looked at the top. It's not a turnip. It's a dead bush. The harvest has failed. I left it too long. God damn it. That was so much work for that. <laughs> I hate farming and my short attention span. Just realized they have a sign outside with the hours. I didn't even need to go in. Oh, I was just gonna say, have you got anything stealable? I'm having a rough time on the farm, so I wouldn't mind just taking this. Here, in return, you can have some of my useless items that I don't want anymore. Oh, I didn't realize someone was in the room. Sorry. I run a small animal shelter. Okay, maybe they don't all need that voice. I run a small animal shelter with some dogs that need a new home. Do you want to adopt one? Yes. Wait, you're going to charge me? What the? All right, well, you know, I've committed to it in my head now, so yes. Oh, I almost walked away without it because my inventory is full. I got a bird's nest here. You can have that. <laughs> Just yank it out of my pocket and dump it on the floor. Are you open yet? Are you open yet? Are you open yet? Oh, for God's sake, we're open every day except Wednesdays and Sunday. God damn it. I'll be back tomorrow. I kind of want to get like a farm building next, like poultry or animal ranch, maybe. That would probably be good income. Less tedious than doing these. Nice name. <laughs> here, boy. Here, little entity dot doggy talents dot doggy talents semicolon dog dot name. Okay, so can I sell all this wheat that I stole? I mean, grew on my other farm over there that you wouldn't have seen yet. Maybe the bread too. Oh, yes. <laughs> Hopefully I make a decent amount of money tonight. Robbery pays off. Got these apples. Don't really need them because sleeping heals me. Yes, melons. <laughs> Found this raspberry bush too. I don't know if it'll grow. It looks a bit diseased right now. <laughs> oh, I've expanded my storage. So now I can just spam things in there and forget about them until they're an inconvenience again. Oh my God. This guy <laughs> sells like cars. <laughs> you said like, oh, welcome to my small workshop. Up. Meanwhile, UFO. <laughs> oh, hot air balloon. I'm so excited. This is so cool. A rocket ship? <laughs> A unicycle. Oh my god. A wagon. <laughs> okay, I, I gotta buy something. I think I'll buy myself a bike. There we go. I don't know how this works. Thank you. <laughs> Woo! Woo! <laughs> oh yes, this is great. Oh my god, I'm gonna be zipping around the island exploring everywhere. This is awesome. He's like, that guy looks a little bit too old to be this excited. <laughs> the store is the best in town. I don't know, the last one's pretty cool. Like, he sells UFOs, you sell bread, and you're like, yeah, my store better. A lot of cool stuff here, like a crop reader, a chisel, a hammer that I'm assuming can do extra stuff. Oh my god, there's so much to this. There's so many different items. A bee smoker, a bee hammer house, screwdriver, multimeter. Oh my god, like I actually want to build and decorate a house now looking at all this furniture. Okay, but I should really get some good seeds here. Wait, you're selling those hemp seeds for 1k? All right, I better hold on to those because they must be good. I have loads of them. Okay, I think I'll go with the expensive one because it's like less to water and there's going to be a lot because I want to make a ton of money here. So I will just buy as many as you will sell me. This may have been a mistake. I didn't think about it at all. <laughs> That's great. That's just lovely. Oh no, I'm getting tired <laughs> and not all the crops are watered yet. Okay, it's even hard to find your way around. I'm just going to commit. Oh wait, I no. <laughs> so if I ate some rotten flesh, would that like keep me alive? <laughs> okay, slightly. Uh, it's wearing off, but maybe I can get them watered. Okay, so maybe I shouldn't just sell all of my food because I might need some. But I got all the good crops watered. These must have been just for spring crops. That That's okay, I guess. All I have is rotten flesh. <laughs> God damn it. Just some psychopath out in the fields eating away at rotten flesh quick before it wears off. Okay, behold my crops. Now I just have to water them for 15 days. I'll be right back. The poor old Irish farmer, our future's now in doubt. Look at all that corn. I'd like to just add it didn't rain a single day. What I've also realized is um, it regrows. <laughs> 
So that means I have to keep watering the damn thing. This is very, very similar to Stardew in that my plans just never go to plan. I think I'm big brain, but I'm actually really, really small, really, really smooth brain. Think of a billiard ball. It takes even longer to harvest them than it does to water them, by the way. What I might do is every day, it just... <laughs> look how good my watering has gotten <laughs> compared to earlier. But I might just leave some of the field die after every harvest because I think this last lasts in autumn as well with corn, just like in Stardew Valley. And to be honest, my sanity cannot handle this for two whole seasons. All right, I'm going to keep like four corn just as something to eat if I need it. And then all of this goes into the selling bin. Oh, this feels nice to finally get them in there. You know what? Thank you guys so much for providing me with this service. Like, I, sorry, sorry I'm, I'm starting to sound corny. 11,000. <laughs> That's more like it. Oh my god, some are ready to harvest already. I've heard my wood and stone prices are crazy, but I consider them fair. I consider you ridiculous. Okay, let's get the crops watered again for today, and then I'll go on a little adventure on my bike and see what we can find. Oh no, I've pushed my bike into your building. If I could just... Ah, ah, sorry about that. <laughs> I'll be on my way. Oh, maybe don't cycle over my own crops. I think it's out this way, the plains. Ow, that is a cool tree. A uh, cool rainbow as well, but how the hell do I get out of here? I'm gonna have to build like a cycle lane through the mountain. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> that could not have gone worse. Is my bike just stuck there now? I think I killed my bike. Yep. <laughs> First journey on my bike is dead, everyone. Oh, I still have plenty of corn on me. Take some corn now. <laughs> That's what I'm going to be living off. You know, there, there's corn. There's corn on the cob. There's popped corn. It's a very versatile meal. Okay, this is a serious problem. I can't really get over this mountain. <laughs> it's like it's purposely keeping me in my village, dividing me from the rest of the world. Like, no wonder they're living in the village with me. They have nowhere else to go. What is this status effect now? Boy, Poison. Feck off. It cured it. <laughs> they just see their village leader running back to them like, I fell off my bike. Okay, so there seems to be flatland this way, but there's no path for me to cross on a bike. So I guess I have to build one. I'm going to have very good infrastructure for a four-person village. Oh, that's just like swampland. It's not actually something I can cycle on. There's a big tower though. Maybe I should check that out. Maybe I should just abandon the bike idea and build a boat. <laughs> I wish there was this much commotion every time I did something small in my day-to-day -day life. Okay, so this is solid, but like there's loads of swampland here. This is useless. Somebody I don't see anything here yet. Oh, is that glowstone? Can I pick that up? Yes, neat. Redstone lamp. The villagers will love that. It's treasure from faraway lands. And by that, I mean like just over the hill. That's where the village is there. You can even see the outline of the other tower, I think. There's another little wooden structure there, which kind of scares me, but we should probably check it out. One there, some ruins. You yeah, know, the place is worth exploring. The hell are you, flamingos? Feck off. I don't know if you're angry, but just feck off in general, okay? You flamingo away if you will. Oh, pigs. All right, good to know you guys live out on this island. I was kind of wondering where I was going to get all my animals from. <laughs> okay, this is definitely the way to explore, like out to sea, the great new world. I can find places and name them after me to go along with the current village, Kevtopia. We could have follow-up villages like Kevtopia 2. The hell, is that the carpenter? <laughs> is that what you get up to when I'm not around? Oh wait, there's a ship. It's way better than my little boat. I call it the SS Kevtopia. <gasps> It even comes with its own crew willing to serve me. Oh god, they have diamond weapons. And some of them are looking at me a little bit funny. Oh god, oh god, they're after me. I've fallen out of my boat. Ah, I've rammed right into him. Okay, this might need some more coordination. But they've got to have treasure or something, surely. I need to know. I'll be back. Okay, well, I know this is my house because I've dammed the river, causing who knows what damage. I don't really get uh, planning in Kevtopia. I just kind of do what I want. Okay, sleep. I think it might be time to actually move into a house <laughs> rather than sleeping in a field. <laughs> Oh, thank God, at least I got to actually sleep. Oh, now it rained. Well, why am I complaining? It still helps. <laughs> but, you know, I just could have done with it a few times earlier. <laughs> no, 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 no! Well, I guess I have less to water now. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Interesting attack. I'm gonna sleep. <laughs> I'm probably better off just sleeping, taking it as a good day of watering and um, just going right back to sleep and getting a sunny day so that the monsters can't hurt me. 
Oh, don't even start with me. <laughs> Comes into my crops, lighting me on fire. My dog's not doing much, I have to say. <laughs> ah, get him. All right, that works too. Oh my god, he almost killed me. No, get away. <laughs> what the hell? I need to build fences. I need to do so much. <laughs> Ah, uh, uh, I'm on fire. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I nearly died. All right, please stop. <laughs> Everything just needs to stop. No. Oh my god. <laughs> Assassino. I'm tired of wandering around. I am dying right now. <laughs> You're fine. <laughs> you were dying earlier when I passed you in the, the boat. All right, I'll talk with him in about an hour and see what he can build for me. I've got so much to do. I gotta, like, convert this into an actual house. I gotta attack the pirate ship. <laughs> gotta take care of the crops. Gotta build a new place. I want to build a place where I can get some animals. I think that would be really beneficial. I see why they say you can build hoppers to sell because this is so slow. <laughs> why are you eating so slow? Yeah, just, just feckin' eat the corn. Are you full or something? <laughs> like force feeding him corn. Come on. <laughs> animal ranch or poultry farm? I, I'm tempted by the animal ranch. Oh, wait, I need the wood. Hold on. I definitely have more. Yes, I have plenty from clearing earlier. At least that was kind of two birds, one stone. All right, an animal ranch. Now, where will we build? Oh, this building is cool. This this is one I can get behind. Oh my god, this terrain is so hard to work with, though. It's absolutely awful. All right, I'm gonna put it there for now, and I'll eventually lower parts of this farm, I think, if the farm even stays here. It's kind of in the middle now, but I think I will live here, and then the place will naturally kind of have this main street, <laughs> if you understand where I'm coming from. I know it's hard to envision right now. Okay, I think that looks good. I'm committed. Go ahead. All right, now you're doing it on purpose. Like, the path is now going through the crops and you're like, no, I'll just go this way. You know what? No time lapse for you. <laughs> You've been getting too much attention anyway. It's pissing me off. I'm the center of attention here. Okay, we got to clear some trees. I got to try and put down a load of torches as well to stop things spawning as much. And we in general just need to clean up this area. It's a mess. Dig up these rotten old cobblestone floors and we'll put in some nice hardwood. <laughs> it's got into the interior design portion. <laughs> no, not quite yet, but we will be buying furniture for this place. It's going to look nice. You know what? This is kind of pointless, isn't it? I might just build a ladder. <laughs> Sounds like a better idea to me. Get rid of all the cobwebs. Nasty, nasty stuff. Get rid of some of these. This is where I'm gonna hang my redstone torch for now. <laughs> I can't even turn it on, but that's where it's going. Okay, I've decided to keep the spiral staircase to keep it, like, authentic and not because it's just a lot of work to do it and it would kind of mess up the whole structure. <laughs> I've been just trying to repair the walls. The whole place is broken in half. You know what? I might actually have to get rid of it because I need the bricks and I don't know where else I'll get this type. All right, here we go. <laughs> I'm going to stop thinking and start doing. Sometimes it's all about taking the plunge and then seeing if you regret it like five minutes later. Ow! Okay, well, I don't regret it. I think it's a good decision. It actually looks kind of cool. I think I'll just patch it up and uh, put a ladder on and then call it a day. Okay, we're up. Jeez, this place is looking pretty cool, I gotta say. I like it a lot. I love the sky in this mod as well. There we go, lighting it up so I can look over them like the overlord that I am. Okay, I might have to get creative with some of these stairs and try and use them in a way that's, like, not obvious they're stairs. Like so. Yeah, that works. No one will ever know except you, me, and the tower. I actually kind of like the little slot it makes. It's kind of just interesting. Little feature. Who knows what it's there for, but <laughs> it's a little feature nonetheless. Ow. <laughs> What a way to go! That was my first death, just falling down my own tower. There we go. Okay, got my stuff back. I just realized they have a way to just enter the house with this. This should not be here. It has a beam coming down and showing me where I died last. Like, I get it's meant to be helpful, but now it's just like it's shaming me. Okay, I repaired them. I need some bars for the windows. <laughs> Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. I just nearly let my angry neighbor in. I can pick up these railings. So you know what? I might just get rid of these railings because I'm not wasting iron building railings like that all the way around. There we go. Getting all repaired up. Oh my God. How the hell did I do that? I just went flying. I keep doing that. And if he came in, I would have been really upset. Can I destroy this and just lock myself in here? Fantastic. I'm going to have to do something about this. Like, at least to have my home protected. This is the first night I've been awake all night. I didn't even kind of realize I was just busy doing my decorating. Okay, I think I'm just going to abandon those crops um, starting tomorrow. <laughs> I can't help myself finish them off whenever I start watering them. Oh, God, it's starting to zoom in. That means I'm getting exhausted. Okay, 
right, well, yeah, they're staying like that for now, but I, I'm gonna stop. Oh, no. Hello, Jim? <laughs> Is that you? Who needs chickens when you can have cows and sheep? I think I'm hallucinating. Okay, so I do have to buy the cows, but I can afford one. I don't see an option for sheep. Oh, that's a sheep? Okay. <laughs> one cow, please. Okay, now, do I have to chain him up? I d Who are you? <laughs> I didn't make a pen for him. I thought this was your kind of deal, you know? All right, you're locked in for now, <laughs> okay? I'll be back with you soon. Oh, no, please don't kill me. I'm blind. Okay, all right. Okay, I can see again. Go corn. I love corn. Wish my dog would ever help me. Just just once. Okay, the one thing I'm not short on is wood. So at least there's that. I can build a little pen for the cow. Oh, I like that I can get through there, but the animal can't. Oh, that I might just do that for the actual fence. That's cool. Okay, come on through. I don't know how to guide you, so just do it yourself, all right? And I'll chain you up when you're ready. All right, does the lead work? Come here. <laughs> Such a bad farmer. Oh, I could have just tied him to something as well, to be fair. But I didn't really want to be cruel. But now that it's done, I may as well just leave him like that, I guess. I love this thing. This is awesome. This is just something you discover yourself and you're like, I am the smartest human ever made. <laughs> is this fella's shop open yet? I want to see what else he can get me. The poultry farm I can build immediately. Where's the next, like, step of buildings? Because I want to get, like, an engineer or a blacksmith or something. A blacksmith would be cool. Feed the cow and give very clean. Oh. What? Why would you teleport it back to me? Oh, oh wait, this is a tutorial. This is your cow. Okay, so there you go. That's some fodder. And I'm giving you a little clean now. Do you want to clean as well? <laughs> you'll get milk every day. To get milk, you'll need to take a milker to them and hold right click until you get what you desire. <laughs> Did you have to phrase it like that? What the hell is a milker though? Like, what do I... I don't understand. Oh, you've got something there. Jesus, the picture for this looks awful. Right, there you go. There's your feet. And I'm going to give you a little brush as well. Ah, you love it. All right, give me the milk. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I won't make that noise next time. All right, that's a lot of fireworks. We're getting some moo moo milk, as the game calls it. Let's see how much that sells for. I've got corn to sell. This inventory is as scattered as my mind, but I'm going to hold the corn until tomorrow, and I'm just going to sell that to see how much gold I get. <laughs> Okay, it's a hundred. That's not bad. A hundred a day? Wait, and do you get a free cow? You get two cows? I think I might have gone overboard with the jail. Okay, just push into me. That's fine. And now we're going to tie this one up. I don't think I need the, the pole, like, stopping them from escaping. I think the rope is just fine. Mm. Feed you, give you a little clean, and take your milk too. <laughs> I lied. Notice how the crops grew around the, where the dog is sitting all the time. The best fertilizer that ever worked for me. I woke up exhausted. <laughs> oh god, I think I'm having like corn related blindness. Okay, we got a lot of corn ready to go. I'm gonna sell my other corn and I think I'm gonna finish off that house and then maybe we attack the pirates. <laughs> what do you say, village? We'll send the cows in first. Okay, I think it's time to let more of the farm die off. <laughs> I think I'm sick of taking care of this ginormous thing. I think I'll just take care of this ginormous side. Like there's still loads and it's made me a huge profit already. I'm just, you know, reaching that retirement age. And look at all the work I've done. Well, by that I mean I cleaned a few trees and um, made a path. But look at all the work I've done. And I'm still not safe. God damn it. You know, I think I'd prefer just a wooden door. <laughs> this is far too much trouble than it's worth. I did also fix this all the way around. My dog is up here. Don't ask me how he climbed the ladder. It freaked me out too. Uh, I'm just going to leave this broken. It's too hard to fix, but honestly, I kind of like it. It's a little bit decrepit, you know? It's tall, hanging in there, but decrepit. Much like myself. We're a fine match, you and I. <laughs> it's actually a really cool place. Did I feed my cows yet? No, I didn't. No. Oh, he loves that, <laughs> taking the milk out of him. And I have a lot to sell, and then we can see where we're at and what we want next. I kind of want a UFO. <laughs> All right, I have 11 and a half thousand, and now what do I have? 19,000. Excellent. Oh, my raspberry bush grew. Excellent. Can I sell that too? Awesome. Oh yeah, I forgot I should probably like uh, clean up my failures. There we go. And that'll return to glorious landscape. Did you forget I asked you to go milk your cow? I did it. What? <coughs> Give me more. <laughs> more milk. <coughs> okay, to progress, we need the poultry farm. So let's get that place down somewhere. It's got to fit here, right? Okay, that won't fit. <laughs> I was like, will that fit? But that actually goes back a long way. Okay, I think you can go there. Come on, dude, get to work. Come on, get over here. And don't stomp on the crops this time. 
want to do some mining while you do that because I've been just struggling by with these half broken and wooden tools. But I need to just gather loads of cobble and get to work. I love how watering the crops just takes it out of him and he's absolutely exhausted to the point of temporary blindness. By this, he could do it all day. <laughs> it's just standard mining. How do you make TNT if you want to blow up pirates? Oh, that's how. <laughs> Hello, are you done? I'm tired of wandering around. I am dying right now. <laughs> and that's how I feel after a day of work outside too. Do you know how to take good care of chickens? No, I don't. Are you... <laughs> You're a weird looking chicken. Sorry, I don't mean to judge. You just, you know, different is all. Oh, you want me to pick up the chicken? Oh, gross. All right, I've picked up the chicken. <laughs> my eyes. Oh my God, he's on my head. <laughs> what do I do now? I put it up on the roof. Okay, she gave me a nest box. What if the chickens just like live in here? Are you cool with that? I'm cool with that. <laughs> there you go. Lay your eggs in there. Some of the crops are just dying off. I don't know if it's because I'm missing them in my haste or if they're just dying. He's just faking eating the corn now. He's not eating it at all. Like, come on, man. You got to keep your strength up. Okay, there we go. It didn't do anything for him. I think we're done with corn. All right, let's set out. Operation Suicide for them. Oh my god, there he is again. He's always out here on his free time. Anyway, hope I see you again. I might come back dead. Oh, the ship is even on my little map. That is so cool. Wait, is there an ocean temple here? Oh my god. <laughs> what the hell? Or is that to do with a mod? I <laughs> Those things terrify me. I gotta sneak my way on here, I think. Hello? <laughs> Just kind of peeking through. Oh, there's a mutiny on board. Now is the perfect time to strike. Uh-oh. Ow. Oh god. Hold on. <laughs> Don't hit me with that diamond sword. Ow, what just hit me? Was that the thing behind me? Oh god, he's joining their fight now. He's joining their fight. That was a neat little escape, if I do say so myself. There's such a pain. Like, I'm already struggling over here. All right, that's one down in dramatic fashion. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, all right. Here's the bone arrow. I can get this one. No, 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 no. I can get this one, I said. How can he shoot down in the water? No, 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 no. Ah, god damn it. Okay, I gotta get back there fast. Oh, I found an egg on the floor as I was running. I found an egg in these trying times. It's a sign of luck. I think that thing is attacking the squid. <laughs> I mean, as long as it's not me, I'm fine with it. Oh, no. Please don't just hang around here and spawn camp me. Okay, I got him. But where's my stuff? Don't tell me it all sank. Oh, that's very far down. Well, don't really have a choice, so here goes nothing. Why are you, like, giving me the happy noises right now? This is not a happy situation to be in. <laughs> oh, it was just supposed to be a quick job. Just go kill some pirates. But it's never that easy, is it? I wish I just had my TNT. If it weren't for those feckers just circling the boat, I think I would have been okay. But they knocked me off my little perch. It was all downhill from there. I love how it tells a little story. <laughs> my death <laughs> and then my death. <laughs> this little armada now up here. <laughs> Because I just fucking can't get this done. I am pretty sure my stuff is doomed. God damn it. All right. The good thing I left behind all my irreplaceable stuff. We're just going to fight this war straight up now. Oh, wait. I think I have enough to um to build my next building. <laughs> oh, wait. It's not open. God damn it. I'll be back. I got to check the other store as well in the morning after this war. Oh, no. I don't want to bring all my smooth stone that took me way too long to get. I'll bring this button. Ready? Enough is enough. That was cruel. <laughs> and then it even gives me a clean up an aisle four message. All right, I'm giving up on my stuff. I couldn't find the dynamite anyway. I don't think it's there. That is a lot of deaths. All right, this time we're just fucking going for it. All right, oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. <laughs> hold on. All right, now we're fucking going for it. All right, oh, hold on. I'm still stuck. I'm freaking him out. He doesn't know what to do. He's got a bow and arrow and he can't get close enough. Oh god, that was a good shot though. Okay, I'm making a run for the ladder. <laughs> Don't know if anyone's up here. No, not on this section anyway. What about at the top? There was someone earlier. Oh yeah, he's there, all right. <laughs> this is why I was bringing the TNT. I just insist on not fighting fair. <laughs> Bye-bye. Oh, wait. Oh, Jesus, that went a lot dodgier than I was hoping for it to go. <laughs> and now we got the googly-eyed captain. Don't really know what he's doing. He's just kind of staring at me. I imagine they were friendly all this time. <laughs> I was just murdering them one by one. Hello, Captain Googly. I do be seeking a parlay. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Not free range. Oh, you were one hit all along. <laughs> I was like, God, I'm clever. <laughs> Hello? Are you a prisoner? Let me know. I'm going to kill you either way, but I'd like to know. I want to know how immersed I should be right now. 
And I'm slowly slaughtering. Oh my god, they had TNT. <laughs> and an iron sword. Okay, this was very worth it. A boat. I don't need one of those. I have many of those. I will take the boxes, though. This new storage for my new house. At least I'm coming out ahead after all those deaths. It's still, like, worth it. Oh my god, there's treasure in here, too. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's not do that now. Oh, <laughs> What an expert move by Call Me Kevin. Pirate genius, they call him. Hi. <laughs> Excellent work. Loads of gold. Another sword. Loads of gunpowder. More gold bars. Coal. I could use that. Always handy. Uh, I could use the beds, actually. I'll take one of your pirate beds. More gold. Sweet Jesus. How much will this sell for, I wonder? And a bow. That's handy. I just need arrows now. Oh, what a beautiful sunrise. Just after I've slaughtered the entire crew and their hostages. I think I'll definitely take one of their pretty banners home. As like a haha, you lost kind of thing. All right, <laughs> let's hop in one of my many boats and get out of here. This is actually a really cool seed. The area is awesome. Like, even look at the map. That looks like it was an actual map in the game. I mean, it is, but you know what I mean? Like, a, a scripted thing. Oh, an ostrich. <laughs> it's so weird just seeing some of the random mobs that are spawned in. Hey, buddy. Still having a, a tough time out there, I see. Aha, now I can make the blacksmith. Okay, wait, how much did that cost? Oh, that's fine. <laughs> I'm kind of regretting not blowing up that boat. I think I'm going to build what I want to build and then go blow up that boat. <laughs> oh, this is a cool little building. I might place this like here. Or should I put it close to my house? Is there space? No, I'm kind of a loner anyway. Oh, wait, it might fit in here maybe. Oh, perfect fit. Makes it a little bit claustrophobic though. I, I don't know. No, I don't think I will. Yeah, that's good. It makes it into kind of a town feel. It's got a little main street here, like I said earlier. I'm going to put on more stone because I need the other building as well to get the mining hut, which will be awesome. That one I'm looking forward to because it sounds like it might be a little bit different. Let's go blow up that boat now <laughs> while he builds. Yay! It's like fireworks for the violent people. <laughs> Take that, pirates. And there's still one TNT left in there. I'm gonna run into that burning ship just to grab it. The villagers are like, Jesus, this guy really holds a grudge. Whoa, someone's been working fast. A bit of lava in here. He's already placed the things. I should probably steal it before the guy shows up. I'll fill his box with flowers so he won't really understand what his job is. Oh, oh my god, sorry. <laughs> I'm like finally moving into my house. <laughs> it took me long enough. I'm kind of going through a goth stage right now. I'm really into it. It's it's not even a phase. It's just like me. Mining hut. Would it fit here? It's growing kind of into trees there. Maybe not the best idea. I guess it would make sense if it was a little bit out of town, right? Yeah, I kind of like that between the water. Like it's off the, the main road just down there a little bit. That works. Okay, I kind of fixed out the front here to all connect up. And now let's go see what this guy actually sells. I'm hoping he can repair stuff. I mean, he sells the tools I need. So at least there's that. He doesn't quite repair them, but stuff like the axe, the sickle, the hoe, I needed all of those. So that that is helpful. Those were necessary. Wait a second. Ha 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 Yes! Robbery! <laughs> I can even move this little selling box to my house now, I guess. Oh, there he goes. I guess he's done the building. Aha! <laughs> just stealing everything. This is great. Oh, I mean, I'm just looking around. This is great. Steal, 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 steal. Oh my god, diamond. Yeah, steal, steal, steal. I'll be back when you're uh, open. See you in a while. I can't really afford much furniture, so I'm just like decorating with whatever I have. It still looks pretty cool, at least. Like, we got some... Oh, a light up there. See, that's cool. And I knew it was there in the corners. Yeah. And we got some cobwebs. We got iron bars. These decorative levers. The goth aesthetic. The selling bin. We got my, my corn dispenser, of course. Where you just click the button and you get corn. So anytime a guest comes over and they want corn, they just click the button and they get corn. It's like a smart home, but with corn. Oh, no. <laughs> Just come into their shop with the milker out. I don't know why I even went in there. I Oh, I, I thought it was the chicken place. I got confused. I wanted to check on my chickens. Any eggs? Oh, man. I can't pick it up. Can I? Oh, wait. No, no. I've got iron. That would have sucked. All right. That actually worked with how I wanted because I want to see can I sell that even though it might be a waste. But I want money. I need to do a little bit of old uh, seizing. This is a Kev Tater ship after all. I need money. <laughs> yeah, sorry. I have to seize property from everyone. It's... um. A big issue in our economy. You see, I loaned out a big loan on behalf of the town, betting on a horse. <laughs> All right, today is big money day. Very big money day. 
I'm gonna sell my diamond too. I'm gonna sell all of this wheat that I stole. I mean, commandeered. Ow, dude, come on, man. I'm a customer, protect me. I want the mining hill. I don't even know what the mining hill is, but I want it. <gasps> yes, I think this is what it is. This is the item I was saying was very different. Okay, I don't know if this will work, but I'm going to try it. I just realized I have like 10 grand again. That was a big sale day. Oh my God, the town is like bustling. It's so cool. And even more corn to sell. <gasps> I slept. And it's autumn. All the trees have changed. Oh, it's so cool in autumn. It looks great. All the colors and everything. Wow, that looks awesome. Planets and everything. I think that's Earth, which explains the weird gravity <laughs> that I'm bouncing around in. It's also like way darker in the morning by the looks of it, which is pretty cool. And all my corn has died, but it served me well. That was a good investment. A very time intensive endeavor as well. <laughs> oh, he's still building away. <laughs> he's got a little bit to go, I think. Oh, he just took an arrow for me, but he keeps on building. Oh my god, I have way more hay to sell as well. My inventory is always a mess. It stresses me out, but I'm not doing anything about it. <laughs> oh, nice painting. I might take this from my house too, as well as the furniture I'm going to buy off you. Okay, get me an engineer's workbench, just so it looks like I'm smart. A tool rack, maybe a little seat, and this oak clock. Oh, my inventory's full, so I didn't get like any of that. Okay, let me do that again. Nice, excellent, thank you. Oh, that's much smaller than I thought it would be. <laughs> there we go. That's better. Up on the workbench. Little tool rack above there. <gasps> it even ticks. <gasps> and it talks. Got my little painting up there. My workbench. What am I missing? My white seat. I think I have everything else. Put that there. Oh, that is so cool. I love it. <laughs> this is really awesome. I'm gonna hang up my pirate banners. I am a, a pirate lord now. <laughs> I mean, all of my stuff came from plundering. So it kind of makes sense to fly the old Jolly Roger. Although it was pirating on land. <gasps> the mine hill is done. Well, at least he seems to be finishing it. No, he's not done it yet. <laughs> Never mind. You're slow, aren't you? <laughs> Just come here to complain. Just waiting for his store to open, so I'm building a little mini bridge <laughs> over this waterfall. That was just an explosion, wasn't it, earlier? But it worked out pretty nicely. I like it. It, like, spirals down into the caves, and it's in between the two buildings. Okay, what do you sell? Mine ladder, mine floor, escape rope. I might buy one of those. I don't know. I just feel like I might need it. He sells dynamite. That's one third the power of a creeper. I'll buy the cheap stuff. It damages me. The other ones don't, but like, I'll be fine. <laughs> I'm really safe and competent. All right, let's go take a look at that mine, shall we? He's just prettying up the place with flowers now for me. It would be so funny to grief him with the dynamite, but I'd just be griefing myself. Wait, has he done it? It has that weird thing. Thing. Mine portal. Oh, it's working. I'm in the mine. Oh, this is so cool. So this is like its own separate kind of universe. I'm not in the same world as my normal world now. And it's the same as Stardew, I believe. So we got these weird little layouts. Can I break these? No, I can't break the ones on the wall either. I think they're just for show. So what am I looking for? I found a ladder. <laughs> There's a lot of ladders. I'm not lighting up the place. I can't really see. I'm just going for ladder after ladder because I don't don't have many torches. <laughs> I thought I would find coal down here, but maybe I was wrong. Ah, uh, here's like a copper node. So I clearly don't have the right tool for this. And there's a reward. These sunbeams I lead. What? Oh my god, this is just a row of ladders. I feel like I'm going down too far. Oh no, okay, there's weird chicken things after me. Oh no, 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 okay, I don't like the haunted chicken levels. Okay, I used my escape rope to get out of here. I did kill the chicken, let it be known that I won the war there. But I'm guessing you need a better tool from the blacksmith in order to collect those little rock nodes. And in that case, that would be a really good source of ore and or rock. Oh look, my chicken's wandering. I'm just gonna leave you out here to fend for yourself. The next day. So I was going to show you a little bit of the mining, but um, I I think the blacksmith has died. I, I haven't seen him in a while. I don't know where he's ran off to. Maybe he's left this abusive village. Talking about getting excited from seeing diamonds in the mine. Kind of boasting there. But I have no idea where he is. But hey, at least I have dynamite now. Like I can just blow up a beehive. <laughs> I didn't think it would just be throwing it. What the hell? And the fact that I can use this outside of the mine is so overpowered. He's running back to his house now. He's like, oh god, why did I arm this man? So I can just throw this at anything. Oh my god, that's amazing. It's probably good that I didn't discover this right till the end. 
attachment dynamite at the squids. Oh my god, this is so cool. <laughs> all right, I used all my dynamite. That was a grand worth of dynamite. But you know what? I think we have done enough for one day. I really hope you've enjoyed this. If you have any mod suggestions for me for Minecraft for long form videos, let me know. Tell me in the comments what your favorite mod is and I'll take a look. Subscribe if you're new and check out some more of my long form content here. I hope you enjoy. Bye for now.